Hey, what is up guys? Guitar Rock here. Welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Okay, so if you guys are not aware, by now, by this week, you should be able to unlock level 6 reputation level in either Mondstadt or Li Yue. So it depends on which one you basically focus on first. Now, I decided to focus on Mondstadt and I believe it doesn't matter which one you focus on. At level 6, you should be able to unlock two things. One is the treasure compass, alright? And one more is the portable waypoint. Now, portable waypoint is pretty cool. You can create a teleport system uh, anywhere on the map. It's portable, you know, you can carry it around. It will only last for seven days. But what excites me the most is the treasure compass. Now, as you can see, I currently have it equipped, alright? So you have to go right here and equip it manually. So pretty cool. So far, I've been trying to use it and you can see what it does is it scans the specific area for treasure chest, which is very, very cool. This is something that I've been waiting for a long time. And I'm sure you guys know, like there's a lot of rumors or there's a lot of uh, players. I mean, leaning towards both sides, one that says that, okay, chest actually responds and one that actually says no. No, it does not. It does not respond. You will only have like new chests spawn on you every time you reach a new adventure rank, right? So like this is just mostly theories and there's no way to prove one way or the other, except for now. Now we have this treasure compass and it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter which one is it. This will help you find your treasure. My first initial impression is like this. All right, when you go to the area, a specific area, all right, you can see uh, exploration progress in this specific area. So for example, Starfell Valley, 95% exploration progress. So this gives me the impression that there is chest right here because it's not 100%. So the areas that are 100%, right, means that all the chests there have already been found. But there's also another speculation that says that even though the exploration progress is 100%, there are still chests to be found in that area. So it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm going to go around hopefully just spamming my Z. <laughs> My Z key, alright, so as you can see, if I spam, it's nothing, alright, so hopefully we'll try to find something soon. Now, uh, the treasure compass is craftable in Wagner or any of the blacksmith, I believe, and you can actually make more than one, I'm not sure if there's any need for that, uh, to be honest, I don't think you need to make more than one. So I don't suggest you guys make more than one because I think it's a bit waste, you, wasteful, you need quite a lot of things, like you need 50 of the blue crystals, I forgot what it's called, but that one is pretty valuable. So just make one and they do they do give you option to make more than one, but there's no need for it. All right, just craft one and yeah, you will have the ability to reuse them, reuse it over and over again. It doesn't like just destroy itself after 100 usage or something like that. If there is no chest nearby, all right, it will basically have a cooldown of five seconds. So you can spam it every five seconds. So I think I found a something right here just now, no? There could be something right here. Alright, if there is something, there will be a path that leads to where it is. Oh! Oh, you guys saw, now it's 30 seconds. So there's a chest nearby. But there's no like, there's no indication or there's no path of anything specifically. So now I'll try to find. Oh! Oh, I saw. I saw there's a chest there. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Ah, so this is it. So right now, let me check. So right now, this area, the bright, the bright crown canyon area is 96%. So if I grab this one, will it increase me to what? 97? Do not wake them up. Do not wake them up. 97. Oh, <laughs> that's how it actually works. So there should be one more chest. So we're just going to spam. I don't explore this area as often. So just gonna move around. So yeah, feel free once you get this. This thing is awesome, man. In my opinion, this is like the best, best item in patch 1.1 for sure, right? All right, so now that I'm high up, you can't use it when you're flying, which is unfortunate, but it's gonna like land right here. Boom. Okay. Nope. So yeah, feel free to to move around and spam it. Nope, nothing here. 
uh, I'm not sure which is better like is it better to like get the high ground before you use it will it be more obvious because sometimes it's quite hard to tell the directions all right how about like now I'm in high ground let's try use it oh there's something okay it's towards that direction so that's how you know I guess it's towards this direction so you have to look at the the path is leading you to so it could be down here somewhere okay let's spam it again I'm dying so let's heal first Okay, it's like down here, so I have to go down. So I have to go down. So there's a chest underneath there. Oh! Okay, so it does work towards uh, these stones as well. Yep, these are the breakable stones. Ah! Alright, so definitely very useful for that. Wow, this is a very useful uh, feature for sure. I would never have come here like... Who, who would come to this corner, right? It's like, there's nothing right here. Literally. Like, even if you grind daily, there's, there's no reason for you to be passing by this area. So I'm glad that, you know, unless you are willing to, like, explore every... Oh, there's one more, there's one more. Okay, it's leaning towards there. Ah, oh, there's a treasure chest somewhere here. I'm not surprised if they are. Like, who would have thought? I would never have come to this specific corner right here. Alright, if you guys happen to be around here just come here and check another chest another chest there's more what yo there's that many chests in this area Woo, that is crazy and i thought i'm done like of course uh just in case you guys don't know this will only unlock for a specific what do you call this uh, a specific region so since mine is unlocked for the monsters one so i can't use this in the us region all right i can't go to there and use it I only try to spam it around here and yes there's a chest oh this feature is so good my god five chests in a row that's crazy is there more all right let me try and spam let me walk around and try and spam i'm not surprised if there's more in this tom terror region because this place is pretty secluded right my god there's actually more <laughs> oh my god how many chests are there like there's actually more okay i didn't notice it uh the first time around the direction where it's leading me to um so you guys have to try to be subtle a bit and try to watch the direction so okay look for the oh so it's going that way so the direction is coming here it's asking me to go here so is it like inside oh oh yes there is there is a chest Alright, this is by far the best feature, man. Like, make sure you guys unlock it. Uh, again, like, depending on which one you're focusing on, either it's in Liyue region or in Mondstadt region, this is, in my opinion, the best item in patch 1.1. Alright, so hopefully now you guys know and try to focus on either one specific and just unlock it today and try to spam this along the way. Uh, there's more! What the <laughs> Oh, there's one more here! What? Why is there so many chests? Wait, how many chests was there? 8 chests in a row? Alright, a lot of these chests are really hidden. Like, there's no way for you to know. Unless you went and used the... Uh, there's an online interactive map for Genshin. Alright, you can use that. But I know not many players have the uh, resources or have the ability to do so. Because some of you play on your phone, right? If you play on your phone, it's quite difficult unless you have a computer nearby you. Or you can like switch your phone between the, the browser and back to the game and back to the browser. It's a bit of a hassle. Using this is just so much more convenient. Alright, so let me know what you guys think of this item. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Give this video a like. I will see you guys in the next one. Have a nice day. Goodbye.